everybody, Jennifer again here to bring you another recommendation from the movie selection we have on Overdrive. I apologize for the lighting. It is what it is right now. So the movie that I'm recommending to you all this time is actually not necessarily the movie, but the group all together. And my recommendation for this week in honor of Art Week is Cirque du Soleil's Jolion. So if you've never heard of Cirque du Soleil, they are a touring troupe that goes all around the world and brings people their art. Their art is a huge stage performance. A lot of times they do their acts underneath a big top and sometimes they actually do it at a stadium. I have been to several Cirque du Soleil shows and every single one is so amazing you don't even understand. I love Cirque du Soleil so much I actually have one of their CDs. Actually, I have two of their CDs, but I don't know where my other one is right now. I love Corteo. It was so good. I love the music so much. Oh my gosh. I would rewatch that several times if I could. I also have a lot of program souvenirs from the shows that I've been to. I went to the Cirque du Soleil Michael Jackson Immortal Tour one, and it is so good. Look at the quality of the photos. Anyway, so the one that we have on our overdrive is Drawleon. Drawleon's story mixes the four different elements. There's water, fire, earth, and air. And they use these elements to bring you a bunch of different acrobatics that mix uh, Chinese traditional acrobatics along with Western ones. In the spirit of Cirque du Soleil, this program is no different. They're tossing balls, they're tossing people, they're tossing laughs. It's just an amazing thing. This one in particular came out in the year 2000, so the quality of the video is not HD, but that's okay because it's not about the quality of the video. It is the quality of the show. Drawleon has several performances. There's people that are doing a modified version of the trapeze, there's people that are doing the silks. They have a juggler, they have contortionists. They have this one in particular, which is a troupe of girls who do a ballet performance on top of light bulbs, which was amazing. And they're balancing each other on top of each other, on top of each other's foot, on one leg. Like, I don't, it's so amazing, honestly. The visuals and the costumes are also really good. There's nothing quite like being underneath the big top and seeing everything live in front of you. This is a good second. And if you've never seen a Cirque du Soleil show, I would suggest watching this just to get your like toes into the water a little bit. And like any Cirque du Soleil show, they actually have a couple of clowns or their version of clowns. These are the people that are distracting you while they set up the next performance. In Drawleon, they have two sets of clowns. Um, one is called Giovanni. He is this man who is the one that is designated pulling people from the crowd. And as somebody that has been in the front line, there's nothing scarier than watching people pick out who they're going to take to the stage from that front line. In this case, it is planned, so obviously the guy that they pull from the crowd is premeditated, but that's okay. It doesn't distract from what he's trying to do, which is make you laugh. There's also a male and female little duo named Le Voila, and they also come out onto the stage. Theirs is a little bit more musical in their distraction, and they also do a couple of different tricks in between. But I was laughing every single time that they would come out. I love their clowns that they bring out. For just being a distraction, usually they are my favorite parts of the shows. They're just so hilarious in the things that they do. They get everybody hyped up, and then it's on to the next performance. A couple of the standouts in this one, I think the very first performance, which is a young woman who is balancing on a block just with one hand. That is one of the most amazing things I've seen. She goes up, she goes down, she goes left, she goes right. She contortions herself all on one hand on a little block. And if that is not the most amazing thing you've ever seen, I don't know what is. But my favorite performance, I think, in the entire show for this one is when they bring out these huge balls and everybody comes and balances on them, which sounds 
generic, but they also have four Chinese dragons that are also performing on the stage at the same time. And at the very end, when all four of the Chinese dragons get on one ball and go up a plank and down a plank, which you have to realize that's eight guys all on this ball, which is not as big as you would think. It is just amazing. I love it. The visual is great. The performance is great. That is by far one of my favorite acts on the video. Now, if you visit our Overdrive page, we also have a couple of other Cirque du Soleil videos on there. This was just the one that I picked that I wanted to watch. Feel free to check out any of the other ones that we do have. There's plenty on there. Also check out all of our other content to see what other movies that we have as well. There's plenty of things, several different genres. There's not just movies, there's books, there's audiobooks, there's so many things on there for you to enjoy. This is just one little droplet in a huge ocean of content that we have. Stay tuned for next week. I believe I will have a book recommendation next week instead of a movie recommendation. We'll see how that goes and we'll see you again later. Bye.